Hi, I'm Nicole, one of SparkPeople.com's fitness experts. Today I'm going to lead you through a butt workout that will take about five minutes of your time. Now we're going to transition through all these exercises really quickly, so just try to stay up with the pace as much as you can. This entire workout will be down on hands and knees the whole time. Just make sure the hands are directly under the shoulders, knees directly underneath the hips, spine should be nice and neutral, abs pulled in tight. I'm going to start on the left leg. Kick that leg all the way out, toes down towards the floor. We're going to exhale, lift the leg up, inhale, take it down. That's it. Make sure you're breathing steady throughout this one. You can take this at your own pace. Think about that toe pointing down towards the floor the whole time as the heel of your foot reaches up towards the ceiling. Spine should be nice and neutral, head and neck looking down. We're going to do eight more on this side. Keep breathing steady. Four more. Here's three. Two. Our last one, we're going to hold it all the way up there as high as you can go, breathing steady. Three. Two, impulsing that leg up a little higher, reaching that heel up towards the ceiling. <sighs> Make sure you're breathing here. Four more. Three, two, last one. Drop that leg all the way down, switching quickly over to the right leg. Same exercise. Exhale, lift it up. Inhale, lower. On this entire workout, you can stay on your hands like this, but if your wrists start to bother you, or your shoulders start getting tired, you can always drop down onto the elbows. You're getting the exact same workout here, just giving those arms and wrists a rest. So take it down to either level. Eight more on this side. Keep that breath going steady. Abs in tight. Here's four, three, two, last one, all the way up with that leg. Hold it steady and breathe and pulse it up a little bit higher. Heel up towards the ceiling. <sighs> Exhale as you lift. Four more. Three, two, last one. Drop that leg down. Switching over back to the left side. We're gonna keep this bend in the knee the whole time and hinge from the hip. Exhale, lifting that leg up. Inhale, taking it down. Notice how my knee stays bent at that same angle the whole time. The foot is nice and flat like you're about to stamp your foot up towards the ceiling with a nice flat sole. Trying to get that thigh up parallel to the floor as high as you can go. <sighs> Keep breathing, eight more here. Take it at your own pace, keep those abs in. And four, three, two, last one. Let's hold it up there one more time. Thighs up parallel to the floor, breathing steady. We're going to pulse it a little higher. Think about stamping that foot up towards the ceiling. Nice and flat. Breathing steady. Four more. Three. Two. Last one. Relax that leg down. Quickly switching over to the right side. Same exercise. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Hinging from that hip. <sighs> Spine should still be neutral. Head and neck looking down. Trying to get that thigh up there parallel to the floor as close to that as you can. Eight more singles. Give those hands a rest if you need to. If your wrists are hurting, drop it down to your elbows. Here's three, two, last one, all the way up and hold it steady. Breathe and pulse it a little higher. Take that foot up there, kick the ceiling with it. <sighs> steady breath, four more, three, Two, last one, and release it down. Transitioning back over to the left side, keeping that same bend in the knee. We're gonna exhale, lift that whole leg up, inhale, release it down. This is like a dog peeing on a fire hydrant. <laughs> Trying to get that whole leg up there parallel to the floor as close as you can, keeping that 90 degree bend at the knee. Remember, you can drop to the elbow at any point. <sighs> Eight more singles here. Exhale as you lift. Last four. Here's three. Two, last one. Up and hold as high as you can take that leg, breathing steady. We're going to finish this one up a little differently with a kick, keeping the leg high. We're going to kick it out, bring the knee into the shoulder. Nice and slow. Leg should be up as high as you can take it. And now, if you can, a little bit faster with that movement. Last four, three, 
Two last one. Quick transition over to the right side to finish up. Exhale, lifting the leg up. Inhale, lowering it down. Trying to get those legs up there parallel to the floor, keeping the 90 degree bend at the knee. As high as you can lift that leg. I know you're getting tired. Eight more here. Try to keep those abs in tight, nice neutral spine. Last four. Here's three. Two, one more time, up and hold. You guys are almost done. Breathing steady, moving on to the kicks, out and in. Notice how I'm trying to keep that leg up there, parallel to the floor, as high as it can go. Two more like this, keep breathing. Now one quick set fast. Here's four, three, two, last one. Bring that knee back in. Let's do a couple quick stretches. Push your weight down into the heels, extending those arms forward. You can shake it side to side with those hips a little bit. And now we're gonna bring the hips up and down towards the floor. Look up with that head. And bring it back to your neutral spine. You're done with our quick butt workout. For more exercise ideas, visit sparkpeople.com.